Mosin. Hey guys, uh, this is going to be Mosin part three. Now this time I got a buddy of mine with me. He, he brought his, it's a model 44, right? Yeah. Mosin Legant model 44. I've still got that 9130. And we've got some paper hung up this time. And we're going to start off about 15 yards just to see where we're at. Let me bring you guys around here and show you. There's him and his rifle. We're going to use a sandbag just to take that part out of it. Let me zoom you guys in. His target's going to be on the left. All right. There. So whenever you're ready, you go ahead. And the reason we're doing this is because both of us haven't ever shot these guns worth nothing. No, they've seen me shoot mine. <laughs> they know I, I can't shoot mine worth a shit. Ready? Yeah, whenever you're ready. That's you too, see that? Yeah. That, no, I mean, that's just too big of a group for this close. <laughs> you got 15 yards. <laughs> We're pretty damn close. All right, that's five with his. Let me get mine loaded up and I'll do five with mine. All right, guys, I've got five loaded in mine. I'm going to aim right for that center red dot. Here we go. Tell you, looking at camcorder, I got it zoomed up, I believe. Yeah, you hitting the red. Gordon took it 15 yards. I think we just ain't no good. <laughs> you ain't that what it is? <laughs> Let me take a look. I honestly didn't think the guns was even that accurate. I thought. Well, I got all five in there. We're going back up some more, guys. All right, guys. That buddy of mine was going to take just a few more shots at 15 rounds. And this is his first shot. 15 yards. Oh, 15, right, or 15 yards, yeah. This is his first shot. So this is the sixth shot, right? Yeah. We didn't have a video taping because we thought it was all right. But... Yeah, we wasn't taping it. But... If this ain't an example of what the, I uh, think Now this uh, is what his model 44 is doing. Look at that. If that that's a hole. That's a keyhole completely. I think that's <laughs> what they call it. Keyhole. And you can see there's the tip of the bullet. There's the back of the bullet. It's the perfect cutout. So his, when his bullet hit, it hit sideways. And yeah. went through that at 15 yards. And I was aiming up here. Yeah. I pulled the trigger there. low and everything. <laughs> and So he's about, what is it, about 14 inches low six or seven inches to the to the left. left and it went in sideways i mean at 15 yards that thing's already flipping <laughs> so that has to be pretty something bad well, anyway hang on all right guys let's go take those last four shots you can, see, you can see that one shot down at the end or the bottom left so we're back 15 yards again here we go go whenever you want to did it again sure. right beside it sure did or if it's Ammo or the barrel wore out? Same, I don't know. That's the same package I opened, you know, with the other. Yeah. Hit up there in the pack there again. Yeah. Okay, you're shooting in that same group now up around the target. That Two of them um, keyhole. Let's see if we can. Yeah, the, yeah, they can see it right there. And the others went back in the group. Right there they are. 
perfect cutouts of little bullets. Hmm. Don't know. All right. 55 yards of the Mosin Nagar. You head just to the, you're on the orange. I'm on the orange? They're just to the right. What are you doing? Trigger pull. Wherever you aimed that time. You went off your own the gray now, quite a bit off. Uh, high. High right? Yeah. Just a few inches to the first shot now, over to the right. You just pull the trigger any saucer if you can. Yeah, you're right there at the first shot. Right there with the first shot. You got three, well, yeah. three of them right there. I mean, if you could learn to pull the trigger any easier, which, I, like you said, you can't pull it yeah. too easy on that. I don't guess that's too bad. Well, it's better than what I thought we could do. All right, guys, this ain't gonna be much of a video. We've learned, well, I'll let him say it. Oh, uh, go ahead. <laughs> In his words, we have learned that uh, his Mosin Nagani is a piece of shit. <laughs> Because about every, what, two or three times it'll keyhole on him. Well, it seemed like something like that. Every four or five, bro. Every four or five times. And he used my ammo, too, so it wasn't the ammo. Then I put some of his ammo into my rifle, that one you're looking at there, and it shot off. It shot good, so. Anyway, I like a, I didn't do a lot of shooting on video, so this might not make it to YouTube. But if it does, always, thanks for watching. And, well, they, they saw me shooting. Didn't they? Yeah, they could, why couldn't you hit the milk jug? Up? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I, now see, I, I'm almost like a challenge. All right, I'm gonna fill a milk jug up and try it one more time. All right, once again, me and my nemesis, Mo, Mosin Nagant versus water jug, 55 yards. Three shots, that's all I'm, that's all I'm getting. I see it leaking, but it didn't bust, so I guess that means I just barely got it. Bleeding. Die, you son of a bitch! It's about damn time! Damn, I don't understand how you can shoot that. <laughs> I don't know how I got it this time and not last time. I don't know. Let's back out. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>